19 verse 21 Many are the plans in a person's heart, but it's the Lord's purpose that prevails. Good evening everybody. As the baby of Bethlehem began the Lamb of Calvary to come back as the King of Eternity, GNMSS would like to share this job through a skit based on the story, The Three Trees. The story reminds us God has a beautiful plan for each one of us. As we lower world's volume, we can listen to His voice and know His will in our life. His ways are not our ways, but His ways are always the best. Let's see the more the children are to offer. Once upon a mountain top, three little trees dreamed of what they wanted to become when they grew up. went by and the trees forgot about their dreams. Then one day a man and a woman came to the bond. The woman gave birth and laid the baby in the feed box made of the first child. The tree could feel the magnitude of this event and the glory of this child. She realized that the greatest treasure of all time, a treasure of immaculate, 
a gift of indescribable and incorruptible. So this Christmas, let us renew our salvation, adore Him and enthrone Him in every aspect of our lives. One evening, a tired traveler and his friends crowded into the old fishing boat. The traveller fell to sleep as the secretary quietly sailed out into the lake. But soon, a thunder and a crashing storm arose. morning, the third tree was startled when her beings were yoker from the forgotten wood pile. She scattered when, a, when the soldiers nailed a man's hand to her. She felt ugly, harsh and cruel. Surely he took up our part pain and bore our suffering, yet we considered him punished by God and taken by him and afflicted. But he was pierced for our transgressions, he was crushed for our iniquities. The punishment that brought us peace was on him, and by his wounds we are healed. It's not all about the manger, or shepherds, or the wise men, it's about the cross. Christmas is about forgiving and restoring relationships. On Sunday morning when the sun rose, the earth trembled with joy beneath her and the third tree knew God's love had changed everything. coming is as imminent as his first. He comes as the King of Kings to wipe away every tear. This is the hope of Christmas, the open of eternal life. May the Holy Spirit of God help us to commit ourselves once again in the Potter's loving hands, be burnt, mold according to his will, so that we will be worthy of the Master's use. For he has a greater plan and purpose for our lives. His ways are though narrow, they are always the best. As we read in Jeremiah 23, verse 11 to 13, For I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord, plans to prosper you and not to harm you, plans to give you a new life and future. You will call on me and come and pray to me. You will seek me and find me. And when you find me on all, with all your heart, on our behalf of GNMSS, Little Fishers and Good News Miracle Ministries Church, we wish you a blessed Christmas and a prosperous New Year. Thank you.